The HP's Book Studio G4 features a clamshell design based on a CNC machined aluminum and die cast magnesium body with diamond cut edges. HP's big selling angle is that the workstation has MIL STD 810G certification, but that doesn't mean it's invulnerable. Instead, it's solid enough to withstand accidental drops and bumps without disturbing its internals. According to HP, you can pound on this laptop with a hammer, and it can withstand the beating. The Dell Precision 5520 doesn't appear to have the same military-grade certification. As for aesthetics, it's an attractive product that looks solidly built. There's no apparent gap between the screen, lid and base unit. However, if you angle the laptop just right, there's a small gap residing between the screen's hinge and the base unit. The screen itself measures 15.6 inches diagonally, sporting bezels on each side that appear to be thicker than what we saw with the Dell Precision 5520, at half an inch wide. The base portion also includes a thin metallic trim extending along the sides as well as the sides of the touchpad. Still, when handling this laptop, you might need a thin pair of gloves. It sports a dark grey theme throughout the design, which will highlight all your finger smudges. The build-up can look rather unattractive, especially in the keyboard area and the laptop's backside. Dark colors never play nice with fingertips anyway unless the manufacturer applies a strong, smudge-resistant coating. Adding to that, we don't recommend playing PC games or using high-demanding applications without some type of lab protection, as the device can get hot both in the area above the keyboard, and underneath. The intake, exhaust area on the bottom measures a large 12 inches wide and 3 inches tall, residing towards the rear of the device.